checking in with you with Lawn Care Marketing Success, lawncaremarketing.org, guys. I'm just going to check in here real quick, show you guys how to make an invoice. This is a dummy account I set up uh, just to show you guys how this works. So we're going to come over here, and if you've already got your customer's input, you can select a customer. If not, just click Add. So we're going to add a customer today. We're going to add Sample, Mix Sample. And sample mix samples business name is sample. And his billing address is going to be 1221 Sample Street. And we'll just go with that because it popped up. But usually you'll fill that all out, guys. And then you'll save the customer information. Once that customer information is saved, guys, or if you've already got the customer and you selected them for the list, the customer's information comes up here, your information comes up here, and then you got these cool little areas where you can thank somebody for their business, you can look at account balances, um, add lot measurements. So like if we wanted to add a lot measurement right now, we could literally put his address in, we could zoom into his address, guys, and we could just measure his lot right here as we're quoting them out and then if he sells we could do the invoice just like that guys I'm not gonna trim around the property like I should just because I'm showing you a different area here but you know we'll do something like this for sample mix sample and you could save once you're done measuring that lot size guys and then it'll have sample mix samples lot size in there so you can go in here and go okay got sample mix sample that's how big his lot is we can give a discount or we can add a product guys so we'll go in here and we can add whatever product we want so we're gonna add leaf care and we can just add that product on and then you can add in your unit price. So lawn care and fertilization, <laughs> if we're doing one treatment on sample, make sample for $57, guys. It'll show up as $57. That'll be the bill and then you can fill the rest of this information out like thank you for your business or we appreciate your patronage, whatever you want to put in there, you know. And you can use this and then once that's done, you're going to click save here. You can save all of this, save all the notes. Now you can go to actions. You can send this to customer, record the payment, create similar, create reoccurring invoice. You can make this invoice reoccur once every couple of weeks, once a month. <laughs> you can set a uh, pending payment, set to paid, or change settings here, just be done. And then that invoice will pop back up when you go to your invoices, guys. Thank you so much for checking it out. We have a few more awesome Yardbook videos coming up, and we hope you guys enjoy them. Have a great evening.